Welcome back to the Getting Started with Click video tutorial series. I'm Matthew Doyle, your narrator from Scaleform. Step 6 Skinning the Video Settings Checkboxes. Checkboxes are really just specialized buttons and are quite easy to skin. You can see the final skinned checkboxes here. Double click one of the checkboxes to enter its timeline. It doesn't matter which one. Then select File, Import to Stage. Browse to and select the file check.psd. Ensure the Create Empty Movie Clip for this layer checkbox is enabled. And also ensure the Convert to Layers dropdown is set to keyframes. Select the first keyframe of the new layer and drag it so that it is above the selected up label on the labels layer. It might be a good idea to zoom in a little, using Control Plus a few times. Insert a new keyframe above the selected disabled label on the new layer. Select the checkmark graphic on the stage while still in the selected disabled keyframe. Set the color effect on the properties panel to alpha and adjust the alpha slider to 50%. Select the old check layer and delete it. Drag the new check layer down until it is above the box layer and below the text field layer. Select file import again and browse to and select the file checkbox.psd. Ensure the create empty movie clip for this layer checkbox is enabled for each layer. And ensure the convert to layers dropdown is set to keyframes. Drag the second keyframe into position above the overstate of the labels layer. Drag the third keyframe above the down state. Insert a new keyframe above the disabled state and insert a new keyframe above the selected up state. Now press delete on the keyboard. Insert new keyframes above selected over, selected down, and selected disabled. Delete the two extra frames at the end of the timeline. Select the first keyframe, Up, and press Ctrl-C to copy the image. Select the selected Up keyframe and press Ctrl-Shift-V to paste the image into the same spot. Now do the same thing for the Over and Down states, copying them into the selected Over and selected Down states respectively. Select the Disabled State keyframe and then select the image on the stage. Set the color effect on the Properties panel to Alpha and adjust the Alpha slider to 50%. With the image selected, press Ctrl-C to copy it. Select the Selected Disabled keyframe and press Ctrl-Shift-V to paste the image into place. Delete the old box layer and drag the new box layer down below the checkmark layer. Select the selected up keyframe of the checkmark layer. Select the checkmark graphic on the stage and use the mouse or arrow keys to align it with the checkbox visually. Repeat this step for the checkmark's selected disabled keyframe. Select frame 1 of the text field layer and adjust the text field font type, size, and color in the Properties panel under the Character Rollout. Press Ctrl-C to copy the text field and select the disabled keyframe of the text field and press Delete. Press Ctrl-Shift-V to paste the text field into place. Change the text field's color on this keyframe to a dark gray. Now select the selected up keyframe of the text field and press delete. Once again, control shift V to paste the text field into place. Select the selected disabled keyframe of the text field and also press delete. And finally press control shift V to paste the text field into place. Change the text field's color on this keyframe to a dark gray. Press scene 1 to return to the main timeline and set the zoom to fit to window. And this concludes step 6. Save your work and test your progress.